before we sort of get into the the the, the details of the film, um, I think it might be helpful to sort of get a sense of of uh, the, the the impetus behind it, and obviously the fact that this is a uh, this is a family production. Uh, it, it's 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 um, uh, if you if you could talk a little bit about what it was like to to sort of create this with with your family. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's it's not easy to explain, and that's kind of that's why we actually shot it because we got sick of uh, we've we volunteered for about six years um, in this program, which was put together by the Inside Circle Foundation and the guys on the inside of uh, Folsom Prison, and we'd come back to work, and people would ask us what we did in that room for four days, and there was never a satisfying answer, and that's really why we decided to shoot it in the first place, to show people. Um, before we did that, we, we talked uh, to the men in blue, the men inside, um, to essentially collaborate with them and to see how we could, or if they were even willing at first, uh, to, to shoot this. And the, their first answer was no. Um, but uh, we, we, we were persistent. We kept, we kept on trying to work together. So, These men, we sit in group once a week. So we're doing this on an ongoing basis. We've got a couple of intensives that we do every year. We do three or four teaching, uh, one day and two days, and do work. So it, it, it is a process that carries on over time. Um, Vegas can probably tell you this better, but when the circles first started, guys would be sitting there, and there would be no dialogue whatsoever. And they would have their weapons somewhere on their body. And one of the first things that began to happen was a man asked another man what his mother's name was. And he, he said, what do you want to know that for? He said, because it'd be harder for me to stick a piece of steel in you if I know your mother's name. And so everybody just went around talking about their mothers. And that kind of broke into a place where people understood that sharing was the vehicle to get there. And I'm not talking about sharing, sharing, you know, like Teletubbies. I'm talking about really getting into what hurts me and what do I do with that hurt and being free enough to go wherever it needed to go. I, I think you could see that it gets pretty volatile and it can be very dangerous in there but we trust that we can hold that in the crucible. 